Tops 1. Posting Cash Receipts. To apply homeowner cash receipts, we begin by clicking on Accounts Receivable on the menu. And then choosing Cash Receipts. You can either click on the black Cash Receipts box on the right or click on Actions. And then add Cash Receipts. To update your posting date, click on the calendar to the right of the post date. And then select the correct date. Let's search for our first homeowner. You can search by name, address, account number, lot number, and more. For this first owner, we'll search by name. Tops1 has found several owners in multiple communities with the last name of Smith. We're looking for Cindy and Joe Smith. Next, we'll enter in the check number. And finally the amount of the check. Clicking the detail button will allow us to view how this check will be distributed. We can change our distribution table and choose a different bank account for the deposit. You can also view the distribution of the funds to the owner's outstanding charges and modify the distribution as needed. To save this check to the batch, click the plus button. We'll look up our next homeowner by address and choose an owner from a different community this time. We'll enter in the check number and payment amount and then add this payment to the batch. Once you've completed entering all payments into the batch, click save. You can see that we've actually created two batches, one for each community. To post the batches, click on each one. Clicking on each batch also allows you to review the batch information and you can edit the batches if needed. Click Post Selected to post the batches. Click Print to print the cash receipt batch reports. We're given two reports. One for each association. You can also view the batch information on the screen. The information for each community is listed separately. If we go back to the Cash Receipts Activity page, you can see each batch is listed on the page for the community. Clicking on the down arrow to the right of the batch allows us to view the details of that batch. Let's add a comment to this batch. We'll first enter in the subject and then the details. Click Add Comment to save. If you scroll down to the bottom of the batch, you can see the comment we added. Clicking the down arrow to the right of the comment will display the comment details. Click the down arrow again on the batch to hide the batch details. This concludes our Tops 1 Posting Cash Receipts tutorial. Thank you.